things family and friends welcome back to the channel guys welcome back to our happy place yes guys back in another one of my favorite stores or locations and look so this is kind of when you come in the store these are cute right so they're in a little round thing when you come in oh gosh look at that three everything's three to five one here these are three and it's so cute it's kind of thin though i feel like you could put that oh, i didn't even see the light i was about to say, i think you can put napkins but they light up all right y'all we're about to get into this location so as i'm looking there's also this cute ghost giving me casper the friendly ghost vibes again they have a light these are new uh oh y'all <laughs> look at me dropping stuff you broke it you bought it okay but this is so cute so so cute have not seen these that is a new find and like i say that's three bucks for those i only see a pumpkin and a ghost we did see this cute light up ghost for five i did not see however the witch's hat that says boo or the cat that says eat that also light up and then here on the opposite side y'all we got some candles and this looks sexy night jasmine let me see Oh, it smells kind of good, y'all. Number three. Okay. Highly fragranced, it says. Now, I don't know about highly, but it does have a nice scent. Now, I want to smell it again. Um, we did come across, I, I think we came across these with these wooden tops, but I love the packaging on that. I think these are five. I do believe they're five. And thank goodness they don't have like a big bright five on it. But yes, usually those are five. They also have these with this beautiful glass. Like, I love the texture. Beautifully designed. They got Energized, Soothing, and Waterfall Willow. And this beautiful turquoise. And then we did see these. We got Cranberry Chutney. We also have this and this. They got a lot, y'all. So, we got Pumpkin Spice with the wooden top. Pumpkin Spice over there in the frosting uh, kind of jar. Yeah, y'all, they doing their thing. Okay, we're about to go ahead and head out and see what else this store has to offer. They also have these swirl pillar candles. Really pretty. I think they make nice decor, table decor. And then they have some vases over here. These are five. And we got the lanterns down there at the bottom for three. Are these vases too? Yeah, I believe these are vases as well. And here we are with some Halloween. I feel like some of this we saw and some of these we didn't. Now, what is this, Dollar Tree? Oh, my goodness. They did not have this last year. So, it's a table decor. Kind of creepy for me, though. I'm seeing a lot of that. I'm trying to see if there's another picture because they seem to, all, seem to all be this one picture with the triple pumpkins and the skull on top. We did see these little rocking characters and you're my boo i think we saw these table decor too this is a trick-or-treat and a beautiful burnt orange and look what's back the beautiful apothecary like jars witches brew zombie brew unfiltered poison hmm, you want to leave that alone <laughs> wool of bat also we've seen these but i know we've had these before but i don't think i've seen them this year with like the roses and the raven I don't think I've seen those just yet. And I know I haven't seen this. Look at this, y'all. It comes, it looks like a skull trophy type of thing, right? <laughs> Do we have awards for Halloween? This would be the trophy for it, guys. <laughs> Look, I'm just dropping stuff today. Man. Look at this one. It's like blue. I'm seeing like a turquoise one. But yeah, I've never seen these either. And look what's behind and behind. Well, I had to move the little character, but y'all, when did they get these taper candles? This is also new for this year. I have not seen that. We got bats and, and we got spider webs. Look at that. Adorable. Would make any tablescape nice and spooky and cute. Oh, and they got the bleeding candles, but they have the smaller ones. So they got that one. Ooh. I mean, y'all, these are so not cute, but I guess cute for those that like it. Um, wouldn't be my choice. <laughs> then they got the cute little pumpkin faces. These are so adorable, the jack-o'-lanterns. Um, yeah, y'all, they didn't put a couple things in here that we have not seen. Okay, DT. And then look at the bowls. You could definitely put those bowls on the trees. A lot of the stores does have the trees. I don't see it 
right here though but they're probably around the corner and then they have the day of the dead copal incense cones as well i don't i can't tell the scents though nope i just see the three different colors but those are cute okay guys i turned the corner and you guys know a lot of our stores that is the beginning that way have snacks in the first aisle and we have come across these uh for the gummies y'all i tried the pineapple oh my gosh so good these are also good i love it right here i just see the blocks and the strawberry but i thought i spotted yeah i spotted something new up here let's see it is by jello so they are jello mini snacks they come in grape strawberry lemon blueberry lime and cherry so they're the little jugs y'all see that the little cups of jello how cool is that? That's a new little snack you give the kiddos in their lunch or just a snack on. So that was new. Oldie but a goodie. Famous Amos cookies. Oh, love these. They go way back with me. <laughs> and let's see. We have seen these. Just checking. There go my lemon cookie. If y'all haven't tried them already, go ahead and get them a try. So good. All right, I think we've seen all of this. And what did they put over here? The last time I was here, this whole section was emptied. So it looks like they added some party things over here. Yeah, they just put party things. You can have like the little cups, the little champagne or ice buckets. I love the scalloped bowls. Those are beautiful to decorate with. But yeah, it looks like that's what they put over here. A couple of storage items and things like that. Okie dokie, guys. We have got to the toy section and i haven't looked at the hot wheels in a little while and a couple of them are grabbing my attention so i don't know if i've seen these but they looking different to me this is hot wire look, look at those teeth y'all oh my goodness we got that one i don't remember this one either let's race but it's speed a dozer so it's a dozer in green y'all know i love that green i'm seeing this one too like are these new heavy hitcher so it's of course a hitch truck don't remember that one it says 24 so i'm wondering if it's for 2024 and look at this dragon blaster definitely have not seen this so have not come across that one love that and then we got this one here nice sorry guys we had a rush of kids right there so i kind of moved down a little bit little kiddos wanted to check out the car so what else do we have i remember these so these are like little simon says games yeah it says classic games which simon says is definitely a classic i was trying to see if it came in different colors it's just all the same color but y'all playing this was so fun trying to keep up yes that will keep your concentration on honey <laughs> you have definitely got to concentrate once that thing starts to go so fast i see my girl y'all know i get happy when i see princess tiana so this is one of those on the go adventures they're able i believe to you know they have the background and they're able to kind of place the little stickers they can take them off look at the joker wait a minute what is that behind? oh that's his jacket i was like what is that behind him a snake i think that's the back of his coat jacket <laughs> But yeah, we have lots of those. Oh, nice to see the doctor set and it's in pink. Y'all see that? So this is the front of the packaging. And then this is what is inside the package. The stethoscope and the scissors. All right, DT. They also have it in green. I don't think anything new has dropped over here in the toys. A lot of this is very familiar. Yep. They still got those Harry Potter um for the lego sets nice so i see that one and then of course that one and then they still got these puzzles but y'all know we're not paying five bucks when dt dropped all those wonderful uh puzzles for a buck 25 over in the other section hopefully you guys have seen those and if you are interested pick them up okay guys over near the books and puzzle books just trying to see if there's anything new over here i see a couple of like the reading books but all of these we have come across all of those um let's see is anything new over here talents in this flower country grid a christmas carol murder i think i think i saw this but i think i saw someone else showing it because i saw something about christmas carol 
a dickens of a crime oh yeah no i think i saw this because i remember that saying um let's see be frank with me the sky is everywhere now i don't remember that <laughs> the sky is everywhere what is that about jandy nelson oh it says stream on um apple tv y'all so this is a actual uh motion picture i guess both a profound meditation on loss and grieving oh and an exhilarating very sexy romance y'all okay now a mo major motion picture what yeah i never even heard of it and look at that you can get the book to it um let's see from me to we we have saw that uh yeah i'm not seeing anything new in this in the books this looks interesting though y'all see that green i love the green popping out uh nama a uh, novel have not seen that a couple new books i guess just a couple what is this searching for sylvia lee yep we definitely saw this one and then we got a lot of jumble books and you guys know i'm not about to go through the jumble but nice that we got a couple new things kind of intertwined in the books Okay, guys, over near Crafter Square items and a couple wooden pieces got my eye, like these beads that are all natural wood looking. That is beautiful. If you just want just the beautiful wood look, you could actually paint these if you wanted to, but y'all know I am in love with that. I don't think I've seen this where it is all just that one color like that. Um, and then this blank canvas type of um, it's not a shadow box, but it looks like it goes back. It is framed. I feel like you could do something with that, DIY that. Um, and I don't know what this is. It's like a tree. I haven't seen that shape either. Look, somebody is saying hello. Somebody's kiddo must have been playing around with that. Hello, world. <laughs> um, but yeah, just a few items I hadn't seen before. A couple of their easels, which are great to find. What else we got over here, guys? What is this? mixing tool set oh okay i'm not sure if that's mixing paint or for mixing resin for some reason i feel like it's for mixing resin which dt does have sometimes like here from resin studio this is pigment ink they have like the little molds form as well that's the earring one this is like uh oh it says a light switch you could actually do a light switch and kind of all right diy your own light switch go ahead got some paints and canvases i do like these paints from dt if i buy paint if it's not something name brand that we find i do however love these by crafter square um i don't do the prang or the acrology a little watery um but the dt did have a name brand paint that i picked up i'm so happy they had it for a little while i don't see any more of it but if you're gonna grab some paint and you see these these are pretty good and some more arts and craft things these are pretty paper flowers that would go so pretty on a card these little mini mushrooms the little wooden mushroom and they have two shapes because this one is shaped this way and then these are a little rounder they just calling them decor look at this sticker ain't she cute oh that's gorgeous y'all oh it's even in blue too Okay, I remember these, the little keychains. And just a little further down, they still got the fruits and things like that, guys. See the limes? If you still wanna work with some of these items, it may be a little late, or you can stock up on them for next year. Look at this, I don't remember this ribbon. Happy birthday, birthday fun. Oh, this is cute. I've never seen that, so it's just a, their ribbons um i guess station or whatever because there are all different types of ribbons here look at this all different oranges we got wine maroon black and white black and gold some we've seen some we haven't look at this one all the gingham nice so i don't i don't remember dt doing that it's been a while since i've seen the ribbon like that Oh, look what they got. So, these are five. I think I did see someone showing these. So, we have, like, been coming across, like, the smaller one of these. But look at these woven baskets. They're huge for five. And they do have them here in gray and in black. Nice. 
Okay guys, over here with some of the knickknacks and I thought this was the store I was in where I found the two white apples. I still have not seen the wooden ceramic looking um, apples just yet. But um, looks like they got to the two white ones y'all that, that were here. But this caught my eye. I feel like it's in the wrong spot. But have you seen these? Oh, this is so fun. So it is a LED pillar candle, and I don't know if you guys can see this, but they're like little drips. They're clear. It looks like a melting candle. And then they also have the scenery of like the ghosts. I have not seen these. So we've got that one, and then this one has got a black, um, and it's a black cat, y'all. Color changing. And I don't know if you have to put the battery. I don't think you do. It, no, it requires two batteries, y'all okay what i have not seen this and then look at the flame it's clear too nice dt that is really really nice i am noticing though a lot of things that we have to put batteries in we have to put the battery some of these light up items do come with the battery but some you definitely have to purchase the batteries for so just check the item that you are purchasing and make sure if that's what you need so you can pick up your batteries and be ready to light up those cute little items Okay, guys, I am going down the aisle with the soaps. There's that scent happy, y'all. This did not make me very happy. <laughs> I did grab, like, the, I want to say red berry one or something of that effect. And uh, I felt like the scent was not very strong or it's really, really quick when you smell it. It does come out foamy, but it does not lather. These, though, yes, on the lather. They lather real good, but not these. This is like water on your hands. But the packaging is so, so cute. And so you think it's, it, you know, it'll work, but it's not like that good. Oh, but look what's back in full effect. And he got the 125. Y'all, this is my favorite, favorite, favorite bar soap from the DT. This stuff is amazing. And they got a lot. And I know they had to just put this because when I bought these before, that 125 was not on there. And let's see, y'all. I see the dupes, but where's sugar cookie? Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah. I'm not seeing sugar cookie, pumpkin spice. I don't know if any of our stores got that yet. We still working with the three we already had. Okie dokie, guys. Over in my next aisle. And your girl is kind of trying to see if I see any of those um, packing cubes. My girl, Money Minded Michelle, actually came across a couple. And I forgot I was even on the hunt till I was watching her video. And I was like, you know what? Let me check, but I, I do check every aisle, so I feel like if I would have saw them or came across them, I definitely would have knew it, but I'm just taking a closer look. Um, this is a giant storage hack. I'm sorry, m hammock, y'all. I don't know where the word hack came from, <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just double checking to see, do I see them? Y'all, look what they got in full effect, too. So many. These storage bins are amazing. I absolutely love them. I love this color, and then they have these two. Nice. I have them everywhere around my house. Great storage bins. Oh, look, they even got the black one. All right, DT. These are so nice, and they're collapsible, as you can see. You just kind of push them down to open them up. They really are so cool. I love Dollar Tree came out with those. Clothes pins. Let's see what else we got over here, y'all. But yeah, I don't see the packing cubes. I definitely want to come across them. I have never seen them. So thank you, Michelle, for showing those packing cubes. I think she found two different kinds. All right, DT. Okay, we are here with our storage bags. Some hefty up there garbage bags as well. Sandwich bags. Now, I think Bowl Roll is probably like their new company. I'm seeing a lot of this in here. Um, but I'm trying to see what do we usually see? It's not bold, sure fresh. We see a lot of sure fresh items. Um, but now bowl roll seems to be their next one. There's those microwavable steam bags, handy wrap. Get 40 in here. These are the zipper seal. Handy wrap is actually the name brand. Nice to see that here. Well, yeah, I think that's all I have so far, guys. I'm going to do a part two for you guys so that we can go ahead and check out the makeup, maybe a couple foodie finds. Um, thank you guys so, so very much for joining me 
for this first half of an awesome Dollar Tree walkthrough. We try to visit Dollar Tree daily because y'all, they drop stuff in here new all the time, all the time. Like, look at this, good days. I literally just saw this on Tish's channel. I had not seen this one. So they have it with the words and plain, but don't forget about this towel. This one feels a little different. So the middle feels like a jean and the outside is kind of soft. So don't forget about those. Uh, too, but yeah, they drop something in new all the time. So always check your DTs when you get a chance. All right, guys, thanks for watching part one. Don't forget to come back for part two. Catch you on the next one.